Want to level up fast? Stay tuned to find out how. Hey there guys, this is Jack One Day talking here and today I've got another video for you. So in today's video I'm going to show you the ultimate god mode glitch. It's going to get you unlimited XP and it's going to keep you alive during zombies. Ranking up to them high level rounds. Plus with zombies and multiplayer all combined with the XP, then it means you're leveling up throughout the whole game. So let's get straight into the glitch. So what you want to do is obviously when you start the game, I'm just playing solo on my own. You want to open all the doors once you've got the money. I would recommend getting this shotgun off the wall because it is OP once packer punched. I would keep a zombie like I have, uh, just one at the end of the round. So you can open all the doors and get sorted, ready for the glitch. So once you've got to the power room, you want to obviously turn the power on and also turn both of the terminals on. One thing I would recommend is to get the packer punch machine there first before you do get into the glitch. But for this video, I'm just going to jump into the glitch, show you what it's about. Then we'll do that later. So what you want to do is come over to these stairs here, as you see, jump over the little rail, walk along this bit and basically run, jump and land sort of on that pipe and then you're in the glitch. You really want to be careful in this glitch because the slight sort of movements too close to the electrical wires, then you'll be able to get hit by the zombies. But sort of too far back where you're close to the stairs, then the zombies will sort of gather underneath you and can hit you from the stairs. Stay until the end of the video and I'll show you the nice sweet spot to tell if you're in a good position or not. As you see, all the zombies pile up just behind the electrical wires. They can't hit you so you don't take any damage and it allows you to just fire all your gun bullets at them. So now I'm going to quickly go into the ether, get the machine part and then put that into the pack a punch machine so I can then pack a punch my guns. This will allow me to pack a punch my guns while sitting in that glitch position giving me basically unlimited ammo. So jumping back into the position, as you can see this zombie is walking towards me from down the stairs and it can actually hit me if I'm too close to the stairs as you just saw. So you want to make sure that you're in the sweet spot and you're not too close to the electrical wires but not too close to the stairs. So I'm going to upgrade my gun with the pack a punch machine, all you got to do is move along, I'll do this at the end of the round or at the start of a new round before there's any zombies. This is useful for getting more ammo or just obviously upgrading the gun to shoot zombies quicker. Like I said, this shotgun is OP once upgraded. It shoots some like fire grenade bullets and it's got no issues killing the Megaton. A few shots later and it's dead, splits into two and you need to remember this because I forgot here and they're still beneath me so they're actually trying to hit me, allowing zombies to gather up as I got too close to the stairs. But here, as you see, still no issues, able to survive and kill the zombies. Just be wary that the shotgun does shoot explosives and they can sort of cause damage to yourself. If you have a ray gun, that's the same issue. You know, you want to make sure that you, are, you have sort of guns that ain't going to be doing that. So I recommend sort of machine guns, LMGs would be perfect. This glitch does also work on dog rounds, which is brilliant. You can pretty much survive the whole game in this one position, which is amazing. At the end of the round you can collect all the sort of pickups uh, just by moving forward past the electrical wires, grabbing all the zombie drops and also yet yeah, again pack punching your gun like so. So I'll quickly show you the sweet spot from what I've found. So what you want to do is kind of go over more towards the stairs way and then go see this corner and basically like make sure you're in line with that and that's kind of in between the little line where the bolts are and right on the edge of the corner. If you are getting hit from the zombies behind the pipes, just move back slightly or if you're getting the zombies sort of collecting underneath you at the stairs, then move forward ever so slightly. Ultimately, this is a great glitch, so use it wisely. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. Please smash the thumbs up if you found this video useful. If you've got any questions or need any help, comment that down below and I'll be there to help. Don't forget to subscribe and turn that bell notification on for more great content like this. I post the latest and greatest news, tips, tricks and glitches like so on gaming and tech. Anyway, peace.